Welcome to TP Tools video series. Today we will show part two of a three-part series featuring how to primer your automobile in order to get a professional paint job. Whether you're a novice or a professional painter, using the Showtime Finisher three-stage HVLP turbine paint spray system from TP Tools will make your dream car a reality. As you recall, our last video showed how to unpack and set up the Showtime 99. We also showed how to mix the primer and decide which gun or guns would be right for your project. In our first video, we used TP Tools 1K self-etching primer and immediately followed with the TP Tools 2K epoxy primer. The 2K epoxy primer seals up the metal so that it doesn't rust while we do the bodywork. Please note there is no sanding between spraying the 1K etching primer and the 2K epoxy primer. They call this a wet on wet application. Epoxy primer is the only product that you are able to apply body filler over other than bare metal. Today we want to show the second stage of priming your vehicle that will not only protect your car's finish, but also work as a filler to give you the smoothest paint job ever. The TP Tools Polyester Primer is for fill only. It will fill the tiny little pinholes left in the body filler and also tighten up the surface tension for the next process, our urethane filling primer. Remember, Paint cannot be directly applied over the polyester primer. So the car is to the point now. We um, did all the filler work with Rage Ultra. It was a really easy sanding filler. Um, we blocked the entire car, did all the repair, blocked it with 80 grit and then with 180 grit. And so the recommended procedure, I know most people will put primer directly over their filler but the recommended procedure is to put polyester over it before you go to primer. So that's what we're doing today. We're using TP's um, polyester primer filler. And you can buy this by the gallon or the quart from TP. It comes with hardener. You'll notice the hardener looks like fiberglass hardener uh, because it is a polyester and it's not a urethane. So it's very similar to this product. So if you were to finish your body work with this filler, you could go to the icing product and put that on over top and then go directly to primer. This, these two products are interchangeable. This is spreadable, this is sprayable. So what we're spraying with is, with TP's gun, um, it's got a, a really heavy viscosity. So we're using their primer gun, but we're using their primer gun with a 2.0 tip. It's the largest tip you can get from TP Tools for the primer gun. So now we're gonna mix the product um, the polyester, it's a hundred parts polyester to five parts catalyst or uh, 20 to one. So this is a two and a half quart mixing cup. We're going to go 40 to two, same as 20 to one. So I marked it on there. It'd be a bit the easiest way to um, do the mix. And always thoroughly shake the can before you use the product. We left it on the shaker because it is thick and you know, heavier viscosity. We left it on the shaker for about 15 minutes. So I'm gonna mix it now. Notice when you mix this product, it smells very familiar like fiberglass. Again, make sure you mix it thoroughly though because um, with such small proportions, you need to make sure it starts to kick before you put it in the gun and put it on the car. If you put too much hardener in, it will kick faster. It'll start to catalyze quicker. So you have to work faster. It'll make, cut your working time down. You can see the viscosity by about how quickly it drains through. You will probably notice that the paint will dry darker in spots. Don't panic. This will even out after sanding. Today we learned how to paint our vehicle using a polyester primer. In our third and final part, we'll show you how to finish the job. 
Our next video, we will use a urethane filling primer. This is used to seal the bodywork and fill in the sandpaper scratches that we created using the 180 grit sandpaper while block sanding the polyester primer. Urethane primer fills, seals, and also continues to tighten up the surface tension. It needs to be coated with urethane primer to get the proper adhesion with the final paint. TP Tools. We have the auto body and restoration tools and equipment you'll need from start to finish. Thanks for watching. See you next time.